Now it takes a shocking act of violence at a place known for peace, the attack at a Bay Area monastery. Good evening, I'm Brian Hackney. Ken's off tonight. And I'm Veronica Dela Cruz. One Buddhist monk is the victim, another monk is the suspect. KPX 5's Devin Feely spoke to a third monk who might have saved the victim's life. Devin? Yeah, it is a strange, almost surreal story of violence in the heart of a community where you would less expect it. The small community of monks who live in this Oakland neighborhood say they are committed to living in peaceful coexistence with one another. But a bizarre and brutal attack has left the leader of their community in the hospital fighting for his life. Well, two Bertrand just chopped him up. Chen Dun Fin says he heard the attack and rushed downstairs to find one of his fellow monks on top of the 66-year-old leader of their community. Then I came running downstairs and then, I don't know, my reaction was so fast, he pushed him, he dropped off with a knife. Finn says the attacker ran away while he frantically called 911 for help. So I grab a towel and put on the victim head and just hold on to the ambulance come. Finn says the attacker had only recently joined the monastery and he's still in disbelief that someone they had welcomed into their home could commit such a violent crime. I feel bad. I thought he was going to be a whole chain person, but something just snapped out of his head. According to the Oakland Police Department, the victim is in critical but stable condition and according to his fellow monk, despite the severity of his injuries, is expected to recover. In Oakland, Devin Feely, KPIX 5.